Greetings, mortals, brother Barlow, and welcome back to more Elden Ring. Like I always say with Dark Souls, just go in and kill them. That's what we're doing. We're just going to go in here, and we are going to kill them. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> I learned last stream that I can parry them, so we are going to practice parrying on a boss when I haven't really practiced parrying pretty much at all. So let's do it. We're going to get right into it. I believe in you. I do not believe in myself. <laughs> not yet. Soon though. He's got my number right now. We can't parry the hammer. Today we have learned. Very bad timing on a lot of that. Yeah. First try was decent. First try was decent, but uh, I made a lot of mistakes. I made a lot of mistakes on the first try there. So we will uh, we will have to slightly get back in the driver's seat here and uh, get practiced with them a little bit more, but uh, we'll get it. It won't take as long to get back into the driver's seat. Gotta shake off the, uh, shake off the nerves just a little bit, you know? This guy intimidates me just a little bit. Alright, I need you to ease up just a tad on me here. Or don't, that's cool too. That's all right, I'll take that trade. Take that trade. Ah, uh, he didn't let me parry him. I did the very wrong move there, but that's okay. This is being very smooth for us. All right, so far so good. Got it. Oh, but I couldn't do the, uh, I couldn't do the repulse. I knew that wasn't gonna hit me. Just play safe. I just gotta play safe. Just gotta play a little safe, hang on. That wasn't a parry, dang it. None of the, none of the, whatever. <laughs> Once you get into the flow, you'll get them. Oh yeah, I I 100% believe that. Oh, let me uh, let me get rid of sub only mode. Sorry everybody. Why does that happen? I don't I'm just going to have to get rid of that feature entirely and if somebody just bots me in the middle like outside of whatever it'll be all right, but Sorry everybody. I got rid of it. Everybody can chat now. Thank you so much, Penguin, for redeeming the uh, sub-only mode thing. That helps me realize what's going on. All right. <laughs> Almost died there. I have to take just one hit and then back up.
All right, we're good. We're good. We are very good right now. Ah, I was hoping that didn't hit, but it did. There he goes. Second form. Here we go. Warrior blood reigns supreme. That whirlwind, man, it catches me off guard all the bloody time. Can't roll off the side, man. Can't do it. This ain't it. This ain't the one. Dang it. What a blues. How you doing, buddy? I'm thinking I can't parry the knives or the Warhammer. I can only parry his staff, is how it's feeling right now with what I've tested. Oh, that did not count. All right, buddy, let's go. Bad timing on me trying to use the uh, seal. Great timing on my seal there, though. All right, buddy, let's go. bad roll on my part way like i did two good rolls and then it just messed up stop playing and get serious hey dude we've been we've been serious for the two hours i've already put on this guy i promise <laughs> i have i have already uh i have already had troubles with him sadly but i have learned quite a bit about the mechanics of this game and they are a lot different than what I'm used to. Hey, thank you for the gifted subs, really. Give me just one second. <laughs> All right, we're into second phase now. Dang. We got six flasks right now in the halfway point though. Hey, buddy we've got you below half i feel really good about myself right now i'm feeling really good about myself right now i tried rolling at the end there Okay. 
All right, buddy. We, we, this is the lowest we've had him in a while. I can't get comboed by him or we're screwed here. Here we go. Last health right here, right here, right here. We're at the moment, we're at the moment. Got him! Yeah! Real early into the stream. What up? Let's go! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yeah! <laughs> What up? <laughs> all it took, all it took was Xanfer's support. Thank you so much, Xanfer, for the five gift subs. Very appreciative. But genuinely, that's all it took. Now to the next hell, right? <laughs> I missed all of the words the dude was saying when I killed him. <laughs> it's a talisman pouch. But brah, like, that was awesome. <laughs> uh, what a way to start the stream, you know? What a great way to start the stream. <laughs> Solid way to start the stream right there, man. What was it, like four tries maybe? What is the uh, talisman? Oh, another. Oh, I can take two now. Oh, dude. Oh, bro. Bro, 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 bro. Talisman pouch is OP for me right now because I own the critical hits restore HP. So when I do backstabs, parries, and repost, I gain HP back. And now I have also stamina recovery. So like... I feel really good about fighting normal enemies for long extended periods of time. Let's go. <laughs> that is awesome. That is an awesome, 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 awesome thing to have right now. So anyway, I guess we will go um, check out the place up here and see what's going on. Oh, I guess I didn't sit down. I need to sit down first. Stormvale Castle. That was awesome. What a what a friggin' way to start the mat. Like that I <laughs> Hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna change the stream title to Margaret Got Got. <laughs> there we go. I updated the stream's title. <laughs> I've dated the, the, the friggin' title uh, to Margaret Got Got. <laughs> oh, Lord. Stop being serious and start playing now. That's right. We we change up the seriousness, and now we start having some fun. No, we, we, we went serious. We got it, and it's good. What? We got two? Like, that was just back-to-back, -back, like, grace spots, man. Whatever. That's really weird to me. I guess I'll go search around this place and see what they got. Bird calling finger remedy. I don't have any idea what to do with those. Hey, there's like a little path down here. Let's go. Let's do it. Oh, wait, how much? I just realized, like, how many souls did he give me? Because I I have not leveled up and I probably should, um, <laughs> I should probably check to see how many souls I got from that boss. I didn't even pay attention. 12K. Okay. That's all right. Souls in this game are like very weird so far, in my opinion. So, um, I'm happy with. I think I want to go more strength because I've got a I got a, a claymore in my backpack. Basically, I got a couple claymores actually, or great swords. Um, so if I can do something with that, that's what would be cool. You there? C come over. What up, bro? How you doing? You got a raspy voice. You need a lozenge? Bro, I've been tarnished for a long time. Very well. I mean, I don't trust you, but I'm I'm willing to go into a, a trap. I like traps, you know? Where where is he telling me to go though? Like this wall or something? The uh, breach the opening right here. Okay. I'm gonna go unnoticed as I make tons and tons and tons and tons of noise. I've got a I gotta jump up here. 
Ruin Fragments. I mean, that's cool too. I'll take Ruin Fragments all day, every day, man. I don't care. Margit's a pushover. He's not a hard boss at all. What am I talking about? Like, I didn't struggle with that. Nah, bro. We didn't have any problems with Margaret. Like, killed him in 10 minutes, bro. Probably the... Whoa. I like this. I'm, I'm, I'm staring at this dude's grapple hook more than I am this bird. Let me just say that, okay? Oh, Lord. I can kill these birds easy. What a bird. <laughs> I was worried that this bird was going to be actually tough. I need a catalyst or like sorcery spell using thingy because uh, clearly something to go do down there. Is that another like, did I see another grace spot here? Good Lord. Bird is always the word, my guy. So Luce, do you plan on playing any uh, Elden Ring or stuff? It is, in my opinion, the best Dark Souls that's been made, so, <laughs> so to speak. Even though it has nothing really to do with Dark Souls, apparently. What up, horn guy? How you doing, buddy? What are you? Ooh, exile armor. What up? Oh, I can one-shot these boys. What up, bruh? <laughs> Zero problems with these guys. I think I need to upgrade my CPU first, run it on a Ryzen 1700X. Uh, I don't know. I don't know much about Ryzen series stuff, so I can't tell you whether or not that's good or not. Um, I know that there's some people that have struggled with it um, with certain CPUs, but like not every CPU is the idea. So I can two-shot these guys. Commoner's garb. I don't feel like I'm undetected though, you know? So. I think the minimum for AMD is 3,300. Yeah, Zen 1 would be pretty rough for the game. That makes sense. I know very, very little about AMD stuff because I don't, I don't go the AMD route pretty much. I'm glad I'm killing these guys in one shot with that attack, because I feel like the uh, battle axe guy that I just saw would probably be a menace to me. Hook claw. Neat. Also, I found like a new body armor here. Exile armor. 14 poise. A little bit less weight. I like it. Yo, I love how it looks on my dude. Like, my helmet goes with this pretty cool. Look at that. My dude's all mysterious looking now. Yo. I like, I'm like. i liking my armor set that I've basically been running here. I'm just kind of going a little bit more poise over time, you know? Until, like, my fast roll doesn't work really good anymore. Because I'm still fast rolling, I believe. So, I'm going to run and jump here because uh, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. I've played enough Souls games to know. Ugh. This might kill me because he keeps blasting me. Bro, I walked into the room and they started blasting, bro. Blast shards. There's not really a plunging attack. It's like a, it's basically a normal attack that just happens in the air rather than like a plunging, plunging attack, which is kind of weird to me, but it's okay. It's locked. Of course it's locked. I'm not surprised it's locked. I knew you would. I knew you would. I bloody knew you would. Try me. See, I saw an item up here. Where did I see it at, though? Oh, it must be up one more level. I know I found, I saw an item up here somewhere. There. Oh, yeah, right there it is. 
We'll head right here and grab it. Gold ruin. Nice. See, I can jump. Yeah. See, that's so weird for me. Like, I, I'm so not used to jumping in a Souls game. So it's like being able to jump is a whole new, like, mechanic that I'm just not used to even still. But I love it. I really do love it. I will always, 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 always love that kind of stuff. Because it adds different kind of depth to uh, what we're doing. Adds a verticality to the game. Boss? Definitely a boss. Different boss or like an area. Patches. I heard you, Patches. I'm going to heal off of that. I love it. I died. Dang it. I was one shot away. <laughs> that close to just killing him in the first try, bro. <laughs> that guy is awesome and I love his armor. He looks cool. That backstab was nasty on him, though. All right, so that's fairly decent ahead of us here. So we'll just kind of, I'm going to kind of run it a little faster now. Dude, I love, I love my blood attack, man. I have been absolutely enamored by this weapon art. And I will, I, I, I am going to stick to this arcane build till the end. Pretty much I'm going for bleed. Like I, I love this idea. Just running through this area now. I need some health back, thank you. I love this um, on criticals gain uh, HP back because I can I can take damage like that right there from my shield and then just get it back. So it's like like me being able to backstab, parry, and repost as often as I am is awesome for this talisman. All right. This dude's been killing people. There we go. I still don't quite have the poise to take on stuff like this. Whoa! Whoa, what is that? I was not ready for that little moment there. I need to heal. I got the backstab. That's all that matters. Get a little bit of that health back. There it is. I got him to bleed too. Rusty key. That probably goes to that door that was locked down there, right? All right, Patches. Where are you at? Because, like, I've almost got a vendetta with you at this point. Curved sword talisman. Would that help me? Probably not, but we might as well look. Oh, it so helps me. Oh Lord, it so helps me. In bosses where I'm not gonna get as much uh, critical attacks or whatever, that weapon art is gonna be nutty for me now. Cause I use a lot of counter attacks. I use a ton of counter attacks. Bro, that's super cool to have. Stuff is like, this area has a lot of stuff for my build so far, what I can tell. Oh wait, it's probably right here, ain't it? Yeah, the door's just like right here. Yeah. What's in here? Not much. Up. Da da da. Da da da. Snake it up. All right, let's see. We got dudes in there. 
we got a dude right here, apparently. Give me my health back, you loser. You touch me and I get my health back. I like it. <laughs> oh, oopsie poopsie. Do I gotta go like, oh, just people dying and falling through the rafters apparently. Ignore them. I'm so glad we got Margit in the first 10 minutes because we can spend the rest of this episode like exploring this castle and like hanging out. Like, I, uh, I was really worried about that taking a heck of a lot longer and that worried me. So, whoop. Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't know. Can I jump up there or something? Is that what this is? Not really. So there's definitely a way to get in there from somewhere else, basically. Unless there's like a, I get a double jump someday or something. Fire grease. Interesting. That's a message, not an item. That's an item. Um, I guess I'll jump to there. Weep. I'm not good at parkour, so I hope there's not like major parkour elements later down the line. Hello, Mr. Assassin Man. Can't parry a shield break. But I can backstab you. What up? <laughs> Dude, I'm working with blood stuff and I love it. More exile armor, nice. Ooh, crossbow. I would like your giant crossbow if it is uh if it's possible for me to get that. Kind of a dope looking crossbow. Item. Brick hammer. Okay, brick hammer. I don't know if that's useful or not. Oh shoot. Hey, this is where the uh this is where the thing is right there. Like Oh, I did it. Oh no, this isn't where the thing is. But that's going to be how I get into it, isn't it? From the outside like that. Where was the one that I saw a minute ago? Is it? Oh, it's down there. It's right there. So I need to... I need to basically... jump from here I feel like that's unsafe oh just barely safe enough give me my health back just barely safe enough get out of here this one right here ain't it was I just wrong? Oh, hello. Yeah. I don't think I know where that body's at now. Climb, climb dang you. Let's go. That one, or no, it's that one. It's, it's somewhere around here. I just can feel it. No? It's above me though, right? Or what? I figured out the outside portion, but I didn't figure out, like, do I gotta jump to it from here maybe? Like, is it something like this where I... Ugh, no weird to me not there not there i don't know i'm gonna have to figure it out from the inside so let's uh let's go back inside and figure out where this is at if it's above me then i just missed it or something okay so that was the area that i was at right there
not that one. Oh, there's an item in that one. Oh. Do I jump from here? Oh, it's up there. It's up way above me, but also here. So let's do that jump. Oh, I don't have to jump. I could just done this. Some fancy arrows. All right, let's go all the way back up to the top and see if we can figure out that one. Cause it's a purple item. It's like a rare item or whatever. So I want to grab it. Okay, so quite literally right there. I just got to kind of memorize that spot. That looks like the brick hammer that guy was holding. It also looked like the guy's armor that I just killed. I haven't found too much armor. Oh yeah, I found like a leather shield. Would that be like um, a shield that does the thing that I want it to do? Strike. No skill. Marred leather skill shield has no no skill whatsoever. Okay. Maybe that's what we uh, we need. I don't know. Ah, I forgot to jump again. Dang it. Did I ever mention how I uh, suck at parkour and parkour is like one of the worst things I can do in a video game? Unless it's like very specific games. <laughs> like I have. Uh, I have basically no uh, timing when it comes to jumping, like whatsoever, hardly. Like even a, even a small jump, like this one right here worries me because uh, I genuinely suck at this kind of stuff. It's that hole right there. Oh, I think I under I think I figured out what I gotta do to get there. I think I've gotta be up on this rampart and then jump from there to there. If not, then it's me jumping from here to there. Which I can try to do. Nope. I'm never gonna make that. So it's definitely going to the rampart and then dropping down from above, it looks like. There's a little bit of a sprint that you can do up this ladder. That's kind of nice. All right, that's enough of that. We're going to go this way now. Haven't been this way yet. Hey, another one of these guys. What's up? Just walking in here, killing everybody. Silver pickled foul foot. Silver pickled. It's, uh, interesting terminology pickled with silver. Wish I could jump on boxes. That'd be kind of cool. No way there's anything in that. Now I'm like wondering about these uh, holes in the wall and whether or not they've got something for me to do in them. You know. Got me curious about them. Also, I'm curious at what's done and made these holes. Because uh, this castle looks like it's basically been blown apart like it's been like blasted by yeah that's what it is it's just like giant holes have been blasted into the side of this place what would do that insane oh these guys are interesting looking Mr. Halberd man you have no shield so I can do this Oh crap. Ease up for a second here, Mr. Sh Mr. Halberd man. I do like the way your halberd looks, I won't lie. Can I have it? Can you give me can you give me the halberd? <laughs> but why do thorns grow in the hole? I don't know. Uh, so the one thing I know about the Souls universe is time is always kind of messed with. So there could have been this epic awesome huge massive war that caused the holes and then like a thousand years later just this massive uh plant demon came through and just started corrupting the entire building or some crap like that like 
it's not a lot oftentimes stuff that you see in a souls game really didn't happen recently or multiple things contributed to the problems that happened there you know what i'm saying so i don't know though <laughs> is the answer <laughs> and i won't know until some lore starts really coming out of this game which I am, I am excited to see. Oh, cool! I can farm this guy if I want to. Where is he? Oh, he's like here. There's a bunch of people that died to him. Look at all these little blood splatters near him. Let's see what my backstab does to him real quick. I might die here. Just because of bad timing. Yep, <laughs> I did really bad timing. He is a strong boy. Oh, I'm gonna have to get that 5k souls now. <laughs> He's a strong boy. I have not seen this walking bell building either yet. It looks like it's like ready to be climbed and look for the weak point. Shadow of the Colossus style. Draw string fire grease. Interesting. All right, buddy. Oh, I lost. I just lost 6k souls. Dang it. Dang it. I just lost 6k souls. All because I tried to do three in a row. That dude's little attack is cool, though. Ah, 6k souls is going to kill me. It's like one level up right now, I think. What am I at on 6k souls? Let's see. Yeah, it's literally it's literally just one level up right now for me. Stop playing and get serious. Yeah, right. I just want to see how much souls he drops. That way I can uh, see if it's worth farming him. Because, like, if he drops even a thousand souls, it's kind of worth me doing. Oh lord, he got me through the floor. Man just got me through the floor, bruh. Four hundred souls is not not really worth it. But it would be cool to like farm him maybe and get his halberd if he drops it. I just don't know if he drops it. I don't really know how the loot drops work in this game just yet, so. Wouldn't be a bad idea to sit there and farm him, though. Whoa! Crossbow man, how you doing? I have to do this. Oh, nope, I gotta jump. There's a jump right there, by the way, guys. Why didn't y'all tell me? Y'all knew that. I know y'all knew that. Why couldn't y'all have told me there was a jump there? <laughs> Clearly there was a jump there. If you just if you just look at it. It's so obvious. That was actually very difficult for me, funny enough. I'm definitely in the area I'm supposed to be right now because the enemies kind of match the damage and HP and stuff that I have. So um, I'm feeling good about where I'm at right this minute. Hey, buddy. I can't get to you from here, so. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Oh, whew, that was spooky. I'm so glad that beam was right there. If that beam wasn't there, I was probably dead. Not me uh, falling constantly. <laughs> I suck at parkour, man. Just got back. Thank you so much for the subs, and for yeah, he gave a bunch of people's uh, subs. Uh, Loose got one. Brickett got one. Rookie got one. You know, I genuinely, uh, no joke. I just noticed the people that got it, like Sir Penguin, awesome dude, always hanging out and doing stuff. Rookie EC, he's always here for the Star Citizen stuff. Really good buddy. He's been on the stream multiple times. Loose, really good real life friend of mine. Zalost, really good real life friend of mine. Brickett, really good friend of mine that talk every day, stuff like that. Like, 
you you hit like five like prominent people in my like stream and career man like <laughs> with uh with a random that's pretty dope what up nas we killed margot uh i did it in 10 minutes he got margot so uh really 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 proud of myself considering how much i struggled yesterday with him on the stream so very good congrats I am so proud of you, Nas. Keep up the awesome work. I'm up here just beating people up now. Oh, Lord. Hello, everybody. I love my blood attack. But I did a few mini bosses. Nice. I'm at the next boss in this area. All right. I'm excited to see the next boss in this area. And now that I know what I know about this game, um, that I can parry bosses, uh, and that I can backstab most bosses, and that I've got counterattacks, and the way that my build is set up, I feel like I can do pretty good on the next few bosses. I'm just feeling a little bit confident is all I'm saying. And that could get knocked down real quick with about 30 deaths to the next boss. <laughs> so we'll see when we get there, you know, <laughs> that's just kind of how it is. Um, I don't think I missed anything up here, but maybe I did. I feel like the area that I just came from didn't have much going on. Or if it did. Oh. Oh. Is that what I gotta do? That doesn't feel like it is uh, a good idea. Technically, I could go down there, but I don't. Yeah, I see people like wandering around down there. Look at this guy skirting around the edges there. There's something down there to get. Oh, I see an item right there, but I don't know if that's good for me to go to and get right now. I don't want to go down there and see what's up with that area. Let's take risks, have fun, right? Let's see what this, this ghosty guy was trying to go do over here. You know, this ghosty guy had an idea. Oh, I see an item over there. Yeah. I think this is where I should go next. I have to choose between these though, don't I? Because if I go that way, I don't think I can get back this way. Is that a bird I have to kill? Oh, it's one of these things. What's up, bird? Light pinion. Oh, Brim, I was busy during the stream yesterday and I haven't got to watch the VOD yet. Could you give me a quick 30 second recap of what you did, where you went? Sure, actually, entirely okay with that. So, fun fact about last stream we wandered around to the back right hand corner here to this place and found a dude that was using blood sword stuff and I killed him and I got my blood sword thing that I've been using a whole bunch of. We then traveled through the land of dragons all the way up through here, ran past a whole bunch of big, super big dragons, messed around with these tree things, trying to figure out how to get the uh, seed upgrade thingy that I had. And then we went over here and I went down this way uh, to this bridge looking for like the entire th exploration was dedicated to finding upgrades for my weapon. And then I went over and started fighting Margit right here and uh, essentially died to him a whole bunch and got really kind of perturbed just a little bit. Um, and I have no idea what I just picked up off this guy. Um, I then started this stream and in the first 10 minutes killed, uh, Margit. So that was kind of awesome. And yes, 
Sir Baldus successfully parried the tree sentinel. I was proud of. Him. I'm still proud of. Him. But um about half of that VOD isn't really needed to be watched because it's just me dying to market for the most part. So if you skip that portion, I would understand entirely. And now we're wandering around in a place that I do not know where to go or what to do, but uh, we're figuring it out. See, what happened to me was until Margit, I didn't really even try parrying bosses for two reasons. One, that usually doesn't work in the other Souls games. And two, I haven't learned parrying as well as I would like. So I uh, basically have just not tried parrying that much. But now I've gotten pretty decent at it. So I am feeling a lot more confident on fighting those kinds of bosses. Like, it, it is very interesting that you can parry most of the bosses in this game. I feel bad when I killed the little pots. Aww. I won't when I get there. <laughs> I need to know if there is loot items. There's a ton of birds up here, bruh. The Claw Talisman. That's kind of dope sounding. What do we got in the Claw Talisman? Enhances jump attack. So like... I don't know. I'm going to make the jump. Huzzah! I did it! Not that it much mattered, but uh... I made the jump. Didn't expect victory. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't expect Victor either. Be wary of fertility. Bruh, like... There's so much stuff. I feel like jumping to there next. Yeah, I'm gonna jump to there next, even though. Nope. Oopsie poopsie. <laughs> I saw that coming. <laughs> Why is 40% of Elden Ring gameplay samurai? I don't know, man, because uh, so far from what I've seen, as like my buddy Zalost has said, uh, katanas aren't doing super great because of the way that they scale and stuff. But um, I don't know because I haven't really messed with really any of the dexterity stuff yet, so... It's hard for me to say whether or not it's uh, it's good or bad. Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> Be careful of fall damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 uh, I expected to die from fall damage at some point going through that area just because of uh, the nature of that area. Oh, yeah, I went up first. So let's go up again. Oh, hey, these guys again. Yeah. I gotta fight through all of this again. Don't you crossbow me in the back, you meanie. Weapon art really makes any weapon into your style and scales with your favorite stat. Yep. I am probably gonna make another character. I wanna do magic. Uh, don't restart. Uh, finish what character you got started. One of the worst things you can do in a Souls game is like restart, because what it is is like, Stats aren't what matter in this game. Like, you could not level up if you wanted to. It's not going to make a big difference. Um, what matters is your your weapons upgrades. So if you've if you've perked into a weapon that you don't like or whatever, um, that could be a problem. But for the most part, oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. So anyway, anyway. anyway, anyway. Cause I, I have a couple, 
I got a couple people that's told me I'm gonna restart, I'm gonna try again, and I'm like, don't do that. That's not a good idea. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna make multiple characters, but I'm gonna finish this one first is my idea. Um, You can always fix a build, so to speak, in a Souls game. Um, like I've, I've mostly specced into arcane and from what I understand, it's pretty much doing nothing. There's been people that have said arcane is basically the resistance of this, uh, of this game, but I'm going to try bleed build out, man. I'm going to make it work. That's my, that's the way I look at it. I'm going into, uh, arcane and magic. But, um, stay quiet for just a second for me. Thank you. I love my blood magic so far, man. Ooh, exiled greaves. Yo, I love these dudes armor. So I'm entirely cool with doing a Hey, that's like a straight, uh, basically the same thing. Nice. Looks good too. Whoop. Nothing like welcome art into holy damage for those pesky skeletons. Sorry, Brim, nothing personal. No, 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 no. I totally get it, man. My, my skeletons be like crazy sometimes, dude. Like I've got to, I got to put them down, you know, Lit us liches. We use, uh, we sometimes use holy, uh, weapons and stuff to, uh, corral the more uh, frantic and frenzied of our denizen. Used a bunch of big words there. I'm really proud of myself. Um, hey, smithing stones. I'm glad I came down here. Good lord. I was worried about not finding very many smithing stones. Luckily, we're getting a few more. This area is like wild to me. There's so much like skirting around objects to find things here. Ugh. Felt like I was going to fall there for a second. This reminds me a little bit of Anerlando, like skirting around buildings in Anerlando, trying to hope that I don't fall off. Luckily, I'm not being attacked by archer dudes or whatever. Ooh, it's one of those guys followed by some extra ads, it looks like. Oh, yeah, I got a crouch mechanic. I got the backstab. Yeah, buddy. Let's go. I'm going to pick up this item, though. I got the hood. Yo, he is. He is so strong. He's a strong boy. I love, I love his playstyle though. I'm real big on halberds and that is, that is right up my alley. I love that big woof, woof he's been doing, man. That is sexy. Is there an easier way to get to him than what I've been doing though? That's the real question. Not entirely sure where I was. I think it's around that building right there. Could I make this jump? Is another question. Or is this going to be fall damage? I can make that jump. Hey, check it out. That saves me a lot of time. I can get back there real quick now. With the swiftness. Yeah, this is in a way different area than the other part that I was at just a second ago. And if I drop down over here, they don't hear me. I 
I just gotta trade. I just gotta trade. It's okay. As long as I trade, we're good. Smoldering butterfly. Very nice. All right, let's check out this place now. I thought that was material to pick up and it wasn't. Can I go through this? No. There's a dude right there. It'd be really cool if I had like a crossbow and could shoot him through that or something. Oh, I found an area back here. Sombering smithing stones. Oh, hey, I remember this place. This is, yeah, we looked down into this area from above. I have another one of these to open this up. Let's do it. I feel like this is a good idea. I have no idea. Oh, it's two of these guys, though. I was right. The battle axe guys are a lot stronger than the other ones. Iron wet blade. I don't know what that is, but uh, we have it now. Mince 40. Ooh, that kind of sounds... It's a dagger. I ain't really big on daggers. Hulk crest wooden shield. That might be a shield I'm looking for. Right. Perry. Perry. I just want to see if the no skill one is actually going to do what I want to do. It does. Oh, it is. It is entirely the thing I'm looking for. So I'm looking for a no skill shield is the idea. No skill shield is, is what I'm looking for. Okay. So this shield right here, if I want it to, I could use my weapon art with it. I actually think I'm going to do that. I, I'll be taking 30% weapon da or damage on stuff, but that's okay. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't deal hardly any damage to me. So that's okay. This is, this is cool. Cause now I don't have to, uh, now I don't have to two hand in order to use my, uh, stuff. Oh, that looks like the dude from the or the, the start of the game? That looks like the dude from the start of the game. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. If we're if we're doing that, I wanna I wanna I wanna set this up better. Hang on. Um uh, curved sword thing. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it looks straight up like the dude from from that killed me instantly in the start. Oh my god. What do you mean? Bruh. I'm able to cheese slightly. So I'm probably going to do that a little bit. It has a lot of damage if I'm not careful though. My bleed. Oh, what? It teleported? What? It just teleported on me. I think it'll teleport again back to the center of the room. Bruh. Okay, 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 okay. I can kill this. I just need some time. It has no name, so it's a regular-ish enemy. Yeah, it's supposedly... Supposedly, it definitely, I think, is a uh, a regular enemy now, which is weird to me. All right, so I need to figure out how to get back there. What a like, what a weird place. This is like, <laughs> this is like a, a maze of rooftops type deal. I have to uh, figure out, maybe there's like an easier way for me to get down there. Cause isn't it like right here? Yeah, it's right here. I don't think I can make that jump. Ugh. Oh, I can. Nice. So we found a quick way to fight it again. I'm letting it kind of come to me a little bit. Uh, 
That's all right. You can scream all you want. As long as I focus on this door. Ow, ow. I hit him through the wall a little bit. We got him this time because we're using this little doorway. I have I have no problem with doing this. I have no problem with doing that. <laughs> that is a that is a very dope way to get rid of that thing. Hopefully it doesn't respawn, but if it does, I'm getting everything I can out of this room. Because if there's like multiples of these, I'm screwed, bro. I am so screwed if there's multiples of those. Hi guys, how you guys doing? Brim the Barlow here, ready to slap you a bit. Smoldering Blutterflies. Good old butterflies, man. So far, I am... I just noticed all the body parts hanging. Whoa. Hey, lion guy. I'm guessing that's the next boss, because I, uh, I remember somebody asking me where I was at, and then they asked me if Lion Guy made sense, and I was like, nope, but I have seen him in the loading screen. The help sucks, so it needs to die, right? <laughs> hey, bud. You're just kind of standing there sulking in a corner. I get it. I feel that, man. <laughs> that guy I just killed had some sad boy vibes for sure. Oh, I found an entirely different area here. Or did I? No, this is the same area. It's just there's a dude down here now. Is that a dragon? What do I see in that window up there? Oh, flag. Those shields do nothing for those guys, basically. I guess we didn't go up here. Oh, one of those guys. Dang. I definitely couldn't take on two of those if there are two anywhere in here. That's the fastest way to kill him, but it is a very... Hey, I got his helmet. I got his helmet. I got his helmet. I, 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 I got his helmet. And it has more poise. It does not go with my... Uh, it does not... Well, I kind of like the flowing back piece there. I don't like it. It doesn't really go with my outfit. Oh yeah, their hood. That like finishes the hood thing there. That doesn't go, but that one does. See, I, I like this. I like this where I've got the little, like I got a helmet underneath the, the shawl thing. So I'm gonna go with it until I find different armor. But anyway. Mimic's veil? What is that? Is that a talisman? No. Huh? Is it an item? No. Is it a crafting item? No. Is it an inventory item? What the heck is a mimic veil? Oh, I saw it just right there. Use FP to mimic nearby object. Oh, and it's reusable. Hey, it's reusable. Oh yes. I am now a tree inside <laughs> of a building. <laughs> kind of a helmet. Bro, this isn't cool. Like, y'all are like torturing giants and stuff out here, man. What are y'all doing? Oh, what? 
Oh, I'm out of FP, so I can't really use that effect anymore, I guess. Lump of Flesh. Chrysalis Memento. Golden Ruin. What is a Chrysalis Memento? Great, now, now we're sitting here, like, looking at this now. What is a Chrysalis Memento? I have literally no idea. Is that a weapon? An item? What the heck is that? <laughs> crazy. That's crazy, man. I don't know. I have no idea what a Chrysalid's Memento is. There's so much stuff in this game. Oh, hey, this is where we just was. So that, that area that we was just at was literally just like right there. Like, this place is massive, man. This area is insanely big. Oh, we just got a shortcut. We just got a shortcut. Let's go. We just got a shortcut. <laughs> I love it. I love finding shortcuts. Uh, Level up, I guess. Nope. Um, I'm not going to use the, the ruin things just yet. So there's one way we haven't went. Um, and I suppose we can go that way now. I don't think we've got very much that's kind of helping us right this minute. Oh, these dudes. Okay. All right. Don't you do this to me. As long as I can like lock onto these guys, we're good pretty much. These are just barrel thrower guys. As long as I can get one hit, we're good. Oh, he blew himself up. <laughs> he just blew himself up. Oh, th oh no, this dude, this guy blew him up. Well, thank you for helping me kill him. I appreciate it. This bird is pissed. Yeah, these birds are mad. I've been killing all the wildlife, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Crazy. Some of these, uh, some of these enemies are something, man. Like. Oh my God. Bird. What up? Bird up. <laughs> <laughs> well thank you guys for watching stay tuned for more hope you guys enjoyed it peace